Hi, this is Johnny. Uh, I'm going to show you how how I scrape the the uh, PC engine, but uh, I want to show you what it looked like after it scrape. So that way you guys will have some idea. But why right now GameCube I can't really test it because it's running on Android and they don't really use the the graphic boxes and stuff like that. So, but the scraper is good for like uh, you know the Linux uh, operating system and uh, Raspberry Pi, and so those and that one is also run in pretty much in Linux operating system and bottleneck uh, as well. So the screen scraper dot fr is tied in with that site. So you have to create an account first and then download this this one. And I'll give you the link to to download this. Now, I'm going to go ahead and extract this, uh, extract this and start from the beginning so you guys will know what I did and how I did it. So I'm going to scrape, uh, let's see, yeah, just scrape it in the same directory here. Okay, so I'm unzipping it using the 7-zip. I extract, extract it to the, the folder itself. It's already finished. I'm going to do refresh. And then I'm going to run this program here, the, the scraper UI. Now, after it scrape, I did the game queue and it took forever, but I created one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven folder. They don't have a mark here. If they do, I would have created the uh, eight of those uh, uh, folder. I prefer to create the folder instead of using one folder called image and everything's in there. So, the file would not have an extra name behind it, it would just be .png. And then you can use this on anything, like PC, you can use it on uh, Raspberry Pi, so all the graphics is there. So this one only has 777, so not everything is scraped. But it's pretty cool, let me go ahead and view it lot larger. So I'm gonna show you how to scrape all these images. Uh, using the PC to scrape it instead of using the uh, Embernec, uh, like 353P or PS. And this is uh, all the, the cartridge, which is the CD, because this uh, GameCube is a CD game, uh, CD platform. So this is all gonna be CD. And uh, I'm gonna scrape the Turbo 16, Turbo 16 CD, and then we're gonna see how it look like after we finish. So view extra. This is a fans art, which is pretty cool because some of the fans art is pretty nice looking, and and also the graphics uh, size is pretty big. is one nine two zero by ten eighty. Now, if you're gonna put this in Raspberry Pi or or handheld, you want to reduce that size because the handheld that size is too big and it will not load. It actually will freeze up and reboot it. So you need to change this size if you're going to use a fan's art. It's because the revolution, res, resolution is too too big for, for the system to handle. All right, and then this is just a 2D box art and that resolution is just fine, 489 by 680. And this is 2D box art and I have 1,185 of this. So that's pretty cool. Uh, so it found the box art more than it found the 2D box art. And this is a mix art. It's only found uh, 290, 200, I mean 920 only, which it have the CD, the box art, and the, but this one did not have a title. Some of them don't have a title, but like this one does, okay? I kind of like it, but it's the guy. This one does, this one does. So I picked the one that have everything, like title and everything. And the scraper is pretty cool. It actually show you what it look like. So, and then the snap is just, I call it snap because Raspberry Pi used the, the snap instead of the video. I could have used video, but I want to, I want to use this for uh, Raspberry Pi in the future because that's what I use most of the time. Uh, meant to use, there's only like 30 second, one minute video. So those are pretty good, cool. But I really not sure what is the the video quality. I don't know. Is it a like a high resolution? If it's a high resolution, uh, the 
small handheld won't able to handle it. Okay, just FYI. And then the wheel is the actually the pretty much like the marquee or the title if you want to call it. And those are the title of the game. So that's pretty cool. All right. So I'm going to show you how to do that. And then the next question is, well, what about the game list? Because you need that to point to the right place. Now, when I first saw this, I thought this game list was kind of ridiculous small. It's only 2K. So what they did is, and this is something is missing a serial text. I don't know why. So those three was created for some crazy reason. But the one you want is this one right here, the gameless.zip. So if you was to uh, unzip this, or let's say, let's open this, 7-zip, archive. This file actually have a very detailed information. So if you click, double click, it will open it. So this is the one you will use for bottleneck, bottle, sys, uh, B A T I think A O C I bot bottleneck or and then Raspberry Pi used that too and Linux program that the gameless used this one as well. So did it open or not? Okay. It's trying to load. I should have just unzipped and replaced those. Let's just extract. Let's replace it. Okay. So now if you look at this file, it's 1,569 gigabyte instead of the 2K. That's, those, that's not the correct one. So the game list here. If you was to open up from Notepad++, you're able to see what's inside, and apparently it's still loading. Okay, we're going to go ahead and open up with Notepad++. And I recommend use that. That's the best one to have. It also have a formula you could create and all that stuff. But this is Notepad++, and you can see that it's, it's grabbing the information from Screen Scraper, dot fr and from french and then it also have release date uh 2020 june 14 and it tell you which company make it publisher and is it the action one one person shooter is one to four player and it gave you the artwork which is right here the artwork dot pmg the image which is the 2d box art and then the thumbnail, which is it's also this thumb, thumbnail is the 3D box art because I name it box art for 3D. And, and this one is the image art. So image mix art is the one that come with like uh, you could see the play game and plus the box art and the, the wheel and everything. So that's mix art. That's the 3D box art. And then snap is the video. So yes, it, so it give you one, two, three box art. It didn't give you everything that I have uh, uh, download. But different program will use it depending on uh, what theme you're using. But so far, based on this, it's only giving me uh, one, two, three. Okay. Uh, so like this one, same thing. One, two, three. So box art, uh, mix art, box art. The 3D box art and then the snap, but it's weird. It doesn't give me the the wheel. The wheel is like giving you the title screen. It doesn't apparently have that here, but it does have the, the other three. So that's interesting. All right, so we're gonna look at that a little bit more. But that's what it looked like after it finished, and then you create all this. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. And so let's go ahead and uh, we are going to go ahead. It already unzipped already. So we're going to go ahead and open this program. Now, when you first time 
uses is going to ask you uh, to log in but when you try to log in using account it doesn't work just let you know okay because you have to say I want to sign up okay but you put putting this username in here and password it and then you click validation is not going to work so you want to click the I don't have an account and I want to register even though you already have account I don't have an account and I don't want to register. So you want to register because you, you, if you wanted to use it quite a bit, you want to register. So I'm going to click on sign up. All right, let me show you this real quick. So if I click I have account and click validate, it's not going to work. Because when I try it first time, oh, it worked. The scrap energy enable okay all right because last time when I did it it didn't work and I think it's also because I already log into uh, to the Google the account from from here I went to uh, screen uh, scrape scraper fr and I already log into my account See Johnny Lou login already. Okay, so when I log into this, then I come here, click here, and validate. If it doesn't, don't worry. Just go in and sign up. And when you sign up, you log. You just put in your. You give your option as well. You know, like uh. Uh, let's see. If you was to choose this one, and you sign up, it's gonna take you to the sign up screen. And instead of choosing new new account you're just going to log in if you log in you just it, it's going to be fine it's going to you just come back here and just click next see right here uh So it's going to come over here and this screen will be open up and then you just come here to this screen so right now there's two screen open up because I already logged into it already but let's just say okay so right here it will populate because I already you could you could click the word register and then it will go down to the bottom and then you just register you know but if you just want to log in just put in your username password and click log in and I already log in here already. Okay, so either way it will work. So let me just close that one up. Out. I'm just gonna click back here. And I did got it working. I'm gonna click next. Okay, this step can take a while, depend on your number of thread. It can take several minutes to finish. It doesn't really take. Too long, but once it's finished, you just go in and click, and then you don't need this anymore. You could just minimize that. So what what I'm going to scrape is inside here. I have another directory called ROM, and then I have the PC engine. Inside, I have no folder at all. So if you scroll all the way down, there's no folder. And this one is PC Engine have 308 game. I finally found the one have the, the full set. And this one is 405, which is PC CD. And then this one should have five game. Oh, nine, nine, one, two. No, actually five, because this is a safe stage. So one, two, three, four, five, yeah, five game. And then Turbo 16 should be like 94, 96. I got 97, I think that's correct. And it's all US, US uh, United States version because Turbo 16 is, is for uh, making uh, for North America. And then uh, CD, it will have both uh, this is the most ever it ever bring to United States. Uh, it's 46 game, USA 
USA version okay and you also use CHD so we want to make sure that when we are scraping we are using the PCE and also we are using the HCD format so let's move this over a little bit I want to make sure I'm view by type so HCD and let's click type again and then uh, that's pretty much it the CSD oh, it does have a backup subdirectory interesting so it will make a backup copy so you don't have to worry about deleting it okay so we got all those in there already and then PC engine you have total of 308 so I want to scrape because I also want the CD uh, because I have a, a AWIO no, I'm sorry AIWO AIWO is a is like a Neo Geo but bigger screen and it used those box on and so uh, I want to create a, a better because I went to draw all those CD I try to search for it and I create those CD image but I want this one because this one give you a very pretty uh, graphic that is more uh, professional CD all right, so I'm going to let this, I guess it does take a few minutes, so let it finish, and then we will come back and I'll show you how to add those seven box off. When you go to lunch box and you click next, it's looking for a lunch box folder. Okay, so that's not going to work. And if you click on Raspberry Pi, for example, it's going to ask you for Raspberry Pi um, no, IP address, stuff like that. Or the Raspberry Pi name so that's not gonna work and if you choose this one let's see what this one does this one will work too you will use the ROM thing okay and then subfolder but I prefer I'm gonna go ahead and use recall box so that's the one we're gonna use instead uh, we poke box have the ROM folder and we're gonna include uh, non non uh, recall box folder as well okay then we are going to uh, get the location which is the ROM folder okay this one I can't delete it because I'm still downloading uh, other CD thing but I went and found mine so I don't really need this one but I it's still downloading so I, don't, I cannot stop it because it's not finished but that shouldn't be a problem okay alright so I'm gonna go ahead and well, it looks like it's already scanned Turbo, Graphite, and PC Engine CD. Huh. So it found... It found those... This two, this two together. This one and this one. And then this two together. Interesting. System detected. It's only recognizing... It's combining these two together. It's combining these two together. And I actually prefer them be separate. Now let's go ahead and do that and see what happened. All right, it's going to emulate the game list, which that's what I want. Uh, it's going to give me uh, this one and this one. But actually, I prefer different one. I want to actually change those. All right, click next. So now I get to uh, do something with this. All right, it found Turbo 16 and Turbo CD, but it also recognize it as a PC engine and PC CD, which is not that what not that's not what I wanted. But okay. So what we're going to do is I 
found two system. Okay, so it's going to scrape both of them. That is the account that I have. Game list. Okay, it's going to back up the existing, compress the game list. Oh, so if you check this, it's going to create a, a zip file for you. Okay, and generate a simple gray folder image. Subfolder. Okay, I want the game rating. I the game name containing. No, I don't want to separate by this little line. So forget that. Uh, game flag as best by screen staff. Guess the rating. Game not found in a separate scrape. So I will know which one did not did not got scrape. Then the media. Okay. So we're going to keep all this the same, move the article at the end of the name. Use a region file when possible, keep underscore file name. Keep file name. Okay. Go to, I did not change anything here. Media. Okay, so we only have two that is in here. And I wanted to have seven. Okay. So the first one is called a mix song, which is come with one, two, three, and plus the picture. And I want to call this a mix art. I don't want to call it media. So mix art. Okay. This one is going to be a 3D box art, but I don't want to call it 3D box art. I'm just going to call it box art. Okay, so I got two of them. So I need to add more. So I'm going to add, and this is a video. Okay, so I'm going to keep, I want to change that to snap because I want to snap. And then I'm going to add another one. And this one is called a screenshot. And I already have the other one, so I don't really need a screenshot. So I'm going to change this. And that is the title of the screenshot. And this is the box on. Okay. So I'm going to keep the box on as image. All right. So I'm going to add another one. And I don't need the side art, the back art. I already got 3D box art. I don't need both pages. I need the cartridge. So it's called support, but I don't want to call it support. I want to call it cartridge. C A R T, C A R T, and then A R T, cartridge artwork. Okay, I'm going to add another one. So I need a wheel. So I'm going to click here to change it. Oh, I do want a fence art. So I want to change that to call F-A-N-A-R-T. If you put it in a different folder, the name will not get changed. It will match the, the ROM's name. So it won't change. Okay, so I'm going to call that fence art. And I think one more is the... The wheel okay so we are going to call that the same the wheel all right and I think that's it because uh, if you do if you if you click anywhere else you could you could get this one carbon wheel but I like I prefer the regular wheel and then you could have stream grid I guess this is more of a marquee, small marquee. So yeah, I do want a marquee. So let's change that to marquee. That's the one that I couldn't find. Now I found it. Marquee, and then I'm gonna add another one, which is the wheel. So let's go backward. Okay, marquee. Oh, I do want okay marquee, not just the. 
let's change this to our K mark here. Screen mark here. Carbon wheel. Where'd it go? All right, let's do this one. Let's make this one and mark here. M A R Q U E E. So this is the RK mark here. That's what I want. And this one, I'll just change it to uh, to a wheel, which is the title. There you go. So W H E E L. Okay. So I have all of them. So if I go back to it, so I got one markia, markia, wheel number two, three, four, five, and six video, seven box art, mix art, eight. So that's good. I found the mark here. That's why I couldn't. I didn't know which one was mark here. Now we have all of them. So now we got everything set up. That's how you do it. If you put in a different folder name, uh, the file will not have the extension of the image. It will just keep it as the ROM name. All right. So we pretty much done. Uh, we could go ahead and scrape this. We size the width, like if you want certain this certain height, you could change it here. Keep the image ratio. Okay, link. So I didn't check anything here, and the image came out pretty good. Okay, so I'm pretty much done. Uh, Miss Lydian, I did not do anything here, but I do wanted to make sure that the game. It's using the correct term, correct name. I want to use 7-zip is there. And I want to make sure the CHD is there. So CHD. I don't see it. It's missing CHD, I think. It does have C U E Q, which is fine. So I'm going to go ahead and add that to it because if you don't have the correct format, it's not going to scrape it, it's not going to recognize it. So we're going to put C H D, we have 7 zip. So that's the only thing is missing from this list. You don't really need any of this thing here actually. You could just cost delete it all and just put seven zip and yeah, you could actually do that. Let's just do all that. Let's, well, it doesn't hurt to leave it there. I'm just gonna leave it. Okay. All right. So when it's ready, you just click play. Uh, scrape all the system may take a long time. Yeah. Go ahead. So it's scraping is going to give you uh, roughly how many days it's going to take. And it does take uh, a couple of days. Okay, it found 608, uh, 687 total of everything that was scraped from the Turbo 16 graphic. So this total 687 and it just scraped three of them. How many system? Two. So you got PC and CD. So right now I guess he's scraping the CD right now because this one is highlighted. And it's gonna take one hour and 38 minutes and 51. So it's not too bad, it's only 600 game total. All right, so when it finished, we're going to see what's out there. Uh, we could actually briefly go to that folder and see what's going on. So if it's doing CD, it should be this one. Date, date, no, nothing here. So maybe doing PC Engine. Yeah, see, one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, I need two more, so you haven't got there yet. So two more folders going to populate. 
So we could uh, now if you look for the game list, it's not going to be there because I told it to zip it up. So once it finished, it's going to create a zip file. So now you got one, two, three, four, five, six, and we need two more. So right now it's scraping the 2D box art, and then it's going to scrape the other two. The other two, uh, we got the video, we got the box art, we need the, uh, we are doing the 2D box art, now we're doing cottage and fans art. So this one just came in, and then next one would be uh, Marquia. Yeah, we are waiting for the Marquia. So Marquia is not showing up yet. So it's doing the, the CD right now. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So one more mark here. So let's go ahead and look inside, see what it looks like. Wow, I already did so much already. This is the box art. So this is the CD box art and it's transparency. So when you click on it, you don't see the white square box here, you just see this picture. And cottage. Here you go, here's the mark here. Then here's all the CD. See, they did their CD very beautiful, nicely. I did my, I kind of tried to copy and cut. So I have some line. This one is very nice and beautiful. So when I saw it scraped the uh, CD very well on the GameCube, I'm like, hey, I need to redo my Turbo 16. So I'm redoing the CD. And then you have Mix Art. Mix Art is mix art which uh it give you the cd the cd case the title and the snapshot of the game and that is pretty cool because it actually tell you what the game is what's the title what it looked like so i like the mix art is it's pretty cool and then you have video okay and the video is actually uh play the Gameplay of the of the the game, and uh, I don't know it would have hurt anything if I try to play one of this. So this is a Japanese game because it's doing PC Engine right now. Okay, and we got the two D box art which I just call it image. So those are the 2D box art, which is pretty cool. And then they got fans art. So somehow it doesn't find a whole bunch of fans art. Because fans art is not as popular, it's just people create it as they go. All right, so you got pretty good. You got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now, since this is not an RK mark here, it's not going to create an RK mark here because it's not RK, it's a home console. So, yeah, we're not going to get a mark here. Even though we request it, we're not going to get it. Unless the game itself it was used to be an RK, then we will get a mark here. But we're just going to get seven of this thing. We're not going to get the mark here. Okay, only if you do the RK, then you could request for a mark here. All right, so it is going along pretty good. So this is like a 400. It's doing the CD right now. And then, so it's doing the first console, which is a CD 687. So it's combining this one with this one because this one has 46. 46 and this one says 687 so and this one have 400 so I don't know how it's getting the 687 not so sure I hope this one did not finish no it did not okay so it's getting this one and it's getting this one but this is only a five game 
I think this is a total of both of them. It's not just so if that's four hundred plus forty six, and then you have yeah. I think the whole thing is six hundred eighty seven. So it's going to take one hour and forty four minutes to complete this. All right, so I'm going to let this run, and once it finished, we are going to look at it and then put it on. I guess I could put it on the my Raspberry Pi and see how it look because I think Raspberry Pi should able to handle the high definition graphic. I'm not so sure. If not, I might have to swing the graphic. All right.